Even in the depths of winter, there are lots of opportunities for angling. And though some watery places can appear empty and desolate, devoid of wildlife, first impressions can be deceptive. Below the surface, the water is alive with wildlife. Small fish show because their safety in numbers, their massed ranks intended to confuse predators. But it doesn't always work because this is a fast food restaurant and they are on the menu. So if you're a baby fish, growing up sure is tough because hungry perch try to make every attack count. This is real jungle warfare, isn't it? Well, it is. It's, uh, it's stalking fishing yeah. at its absolute best. And the I've just, thing, I've yeah. just seen the tail of a fish in those lilies there, so I, I think you could be on quick here, big time. He saw the line, he didn't like it. It's coming back. That was close, wasn't it? It's enough. It's well done. <laughs> And they said rock and roll was dead. Don't try and don't try and stop it on I'm that not, reel. Let not, me get the I'm net. I'm not stopping Goodness him, John. <laughs> right, well done. Wasn't that a great take? And didn't keep your rod really low, Bernard. Really low, because he's, he'll go right under these roots. Yeah, I'm working well here. Keep him on that length line. I've got to cut a biggest gudgeon in the lake. Yeah. This is a grand gudgeon altogether. Please don't You're Finally, talk. here we go. Have you, got your, nice net? Have you got your net, Captain? It's a common, it's a it's common. It's coming over your net what now. What a beautiful fish. Let's have a look at it. Thank oh. you. And it's in the net. <laughs> and it's, it's a double figure common. Yes. On a fly rod. Well done, John. Yes, here we are. Oh, that's got to be my <laughs> biggest fish of the carp family on a fly that rod. That is a beauty. What a corker. Look at that. Isn't that right? <laughs> Magnificent common. Now, we're not going to weigh it, but what do you estimate? Oh, about 15? Well, 12. 13 or 14, I would say. Go on, then. Put Let's him put back. him back straight away. Yeah. Yeah. Isn't it? It's a beautiful yeah. fish. I, I love I commons. You you won't I just love commons. Where you go. Oh, thank you, fish. Oh, oh, oh. A baptism. I didn't want to go in there. No, no. We'll go out there. A bright sunrise is usually the kiss of death for bream anglers. But, as the saying goes, there's always a chance. Reasonable size? Yeah, it's pulling okay. I mean... As far as bream go? As far as bream go, I mean, you don't expect miracles with them but this one feels quite heavy in the margins um, get up and go decent fish get on the line and green well done When the frost relents and the water temperature rises a bit, these dace will start to feed. They're shoal fish that delight in fast-flowing, shallow rivers. They don't grow very big, most weighing just a few ounces. But we're hoping to catch one of over a pound. This doesn't sound much, but it certainly qualifies as an impossible-sized fish. And Martin will need all his concentration and cunning to succeed. Yep. Oh, you're a big dice. Oh, 
know if it's a dace, it's quite big. I don't know, where's he got me? Trying to get me under the bank. Oh, if that's a dace, that's very big. Please. Oh, is it a dace? Let's have a look at you. It's a dace. Be nice to me. Oh, come on. Yes. That's a monster. That's a British record at spawning time. Put that in. Free spool. That's the spot, is it? That's the spot. <laughs> is that your real chicken? Yeah, I'm away. Yes, there we go. Oh, are you enjoying oh, it? Oh, yeah. yeah well. Oh, big oh, fish. It's not, not a bad fish, is it? Oh, yeah, good hey? fish. Oh, it looks a very fair fish. Do you fish. want me to net him or club him? Oh, it looks a bit, you know. Oh. <laughs> Here we go. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> nice one, John. Well, I wouldn't have believed it. <laughs> God, you're a jappy devil, aren't you? <laughs> you caught the biggest fish here.